Hello heroes, welcome back to Let's Play Legend of Zelda, the Oracle of Ages, with me, Voltage Megamer. Today we're going to actually give him the Zora Scale. Thank you. You're a good man. Ahoy, mateys. We're off to Eldrum, the land of seasons. Aye, aye, sir. Thank you. Now we can escape these seas. Take this as a sign of me thanks. And the jewel called the Toke Eyeball. It's said to be the thing that opens the way to the ancient tomb. I don't know if it's true or not, though. You got the Toke Eyeball, a treasure of the deep. You've really helped us out. Aye, we found that Toke Eyeball on the Crescent Island. Maybe you should head that way. We're off now. Ahoy, mateys. Aye, aye, sir. There's another, uh, underwater cave here, if you go into the present. But, in this game, there's no way for me to get there. I'm serious, there's... You can only get that ring if you're in a return game. It's not one of those rings that you can also get from a tree or anything. Some of the rings, most of the rings that you find in chests, are exclusive. Like this one. Before, when we came here, we did not have the reach. But now we have... The long switch! Hooray! Alright, and with that out of the way, we can go to Toke Island. Because there's gonna be another ring there! Actually, it'd probably be preferential if I just... Wait. Right, the, the thing isn't there in the past. Right. I was thinking I could just go to the present. It... Yeah, that would work. Ah, I'm silly. Oh, well, I'm too far away from land to do that now. Oh, I could just go around and do that, but no. Also, I was tempted to take the raft there. Right there. I didn't do it, though. Nope, not this way. That way leads to the shield, which I already have. Hey, this looks good. Pop. Alright, that's where you need to go, but that's not what I'm going to do right now. What I want to do right now is, uh... Go to the other side of the island. There's something over there that we might have seen before. I'm not sure if I showed it or not. And, uh... Oh, no. Right, 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 sword, 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 sword. Jump away! Yeah, here it is, this cave. This cave, where we could do nothing before. Now that we have the long switch, we can get over here. And get this chest. For another magical ring! Hooray! Oh, you thought we were done with rings? Not yet! Uh, I will go back... here, to town. Because we need to get them appraised. Also, there's another ring that I forgot. For a second. It requires that I teleport here. Or not teleport, but time warp. And, remember the mayor's house? Remember this? Yeah, we can get this now. Your stuff is mine, Mayor. I got a ring. Get it appraised later. Why not get it appraised right now? Since we're right next to the shop, I can appraise all the rings. I think. I can appraise seven rings. Appraise. Alright, let's see here. This is a red luck ring. Half damage from spiked floors. No damage from electricity. Another like like ring. Cool, I can sell it. Yay, 10 rupee profit. Whimsical ring. Sword damage down, sometimes kill things in one hit. Alright, that's cool. Pegasus ring. Seeds last longer. Red holy ring. No damage from small rocks. I wonder what that counts. Oh well. Power ring level 2. Sword damage up, damage taken way up. Ah. I'm not a big fan of those. Green luck ring, half damage from traps. 
All right, we appraised a ton of rings. Also, while we're here, let's go ahead and talk to uh, the little kid, Tippin. Yeah, that's why I named him. My baby never sleeps. How can I get him to sleep, Link? Sing or play? I'm gonna say sing because that's what I'm going for. I like to sing. I'll give it a try. Well, isn't he a darling baby? Parent of the year. Well, I can't really say that. I mean, Link's never there. Also, some people ask me, what's this hole? This hole lets you transfer stuff from other games. Welcome, Link. I'm Voro, Oracle of Secrets. This is a hall of secrets, where your secrets take form. But at all times and places, you will hear powerful secrets. At those times, come see me. I can give shape and form to your secrets. Yeah. Um, I know how that works, but it's hard to explain how it works. Yeah, well, you can also climb up here and... Hey, there's a geisha seat. As you get things, more things will appear up here. Like, as you get the essences of time in this game's case, more caves will open up. Another geisha seed. Another little room. I don't remember what the purpose of these little rooms are, but... Either way, it's hard to walk around here, because it's all so thick and grassy. More geisha seed. And another empty room. Hooray! Maybe if I walk into the middle of these rooms... Nah, nothing. Ah, well. I'll probably have one of you guys tell me, since I can't remember. Anyway, yeah, if you enter in one of those secrets, then they'll appear as a chest right here. And once you give them another secret, another chest will appear right there. Hear that or the item, it will drop from the ceiling. I forget how it works. In any event, we need to be in the past. So, time warp. Hooray! Now that we're in the past, I can get that geisha seed tree that I planted forever and a half ago. Just want to see what's in it before I forget. Oh hey, holes in the ground. Oh, hey, water. Hey, there, Geisha Nut. It had a ring! I don't even have the money to appraise it right now. Oh, well. Anyway, let's, uh... Alright. Gotta do it this way. Don't feel like walking back to my other portal. I can make new portals wherever I choose. Yeah, warp here. We're going back to that eye thing. Which should be right here. There we go. So technically this place would have never been open if we didn't go back in time. Show your courage, wisdom, and power. The road to the past shall then open. I don't have time to do this whole area in this video, but... I can show an interesting way to deal with these guys. Set them on fire, their wrappings come off. Yeah, neat, isn't it? Hooray, fire. More fire. Fire power. I almost think they're more dangerous in that form, but anyway, I just wanted to show that. Ow. Next time on Let's Play Legend of Zelda The Oracle of Ages, I'll continue and do- Oh wait, I still have a little bit of time. Alright, check for dealing with these. Run past. Place tr Ah, it didn't work. There we go. Uh, now you kill yourself with a bomb. Or not. Another trick. Do this. Come on. If you're pushing up a wall correctly or something like that, it should put it on the other side, but it didn't. Ah, well. Uh, how to deal with these? Push. Wait, I know. Kill. And push. Push. 
push, 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 in. Oh, I wanted these. Alright, the good point to stop is any. See you later, heroes.